What's up, Moeo tribe? Running on the trail today, and spring is in full swing. And I noticed on the trail today two things that I haven't seen or heard in probably seven months. And as I was running, the first realization that came to me, I'm running along, and all of a sudden I hear all throughout this area that you might be able to hear right now is tree frogs. I can hear tree frogs all around me croaking out their song. And I started thinking, I haven't seen that, heard that in like seven months because it's been winter. And I've been running this trail most days every week and haven't heard that at all. So I thought, yes, I was so excited. It really is spring, summer's on its way. My favorite time of the year. So exciting just to hear the tree frogs. It's a sign, a big bright flag waving saying, it's spring, it's getting warmer. And I'm excited. And as I was running along, thinking how excited I was, I started glancing into the trees, looking at different areas, and all of a sudden, I saw something that I haven't seen or noticed in months. Poison ivy already growing all over the side of the trail. Tree frogs and poison ivy, both symbols the spring is here and summer's on its way, which is so exciting to me, but both so incredibly different. The tree frogs are beautiful to hear. I love going to sleep at night, listening to the song of tree frogs. But if I touch that poison ivy, I'm allergic to it. And I break out into a terrible rash that just itches without relief, fire under my skin, constant pain and time and burning. And I have to take medicine to stop it. But one doesn't come without the other. Spring and summer doesn't come without poison ivy. It doesn't come without tree frogs. You can't just always have the good. The good and the bad come together and you have to take them together. But the key is, can you find the ability to see the good and see the bad and understand that they're both always there. And you have to be able to enjoy the beauty in the good and understand that the bad is going to be there and you just have to live with it. Now I say good and bad, that's arbitrary statements. Whether it's good, whether it's bad, it's hard to say. It just is. And in life, it's the same way. Sometimes something that we feel in our heart is good happens. And not long after, something that we see as bad happens. But as the saying goes, there's a silver lining to every dark cloud. Can we learn to quit seeing things as good and bad? and just see things as opportunities to take advantage of. Tree frogs and poison ivy, they're both an opportunity to enjoy the beautiful weather of the summer and all that it has to offer. What are you gonna do with your opportunity? Moyo, everywhere we go.